If you want to create a app but don't know the coding skills and the development process then in this video I am going to showcase and give you a demo of a platform with the help of you can create the beautiful stunning looking apps and best part you don't need any coding skills at all. This platform is going to handle everything. So the platform or the tool name is the app my side and with this tool you can get your desired app in just three steps first you have to connect with your database after that you need to personalize the app like the layout fonts text and these banners and after that you are going to publish it on the apple store or the android play store and the best thing i liked about this platform that it works and they connect with everything whether it's the wordpress woocommerce web custom app or the shopify you can connect any kind of the platform or website and create your desired app so hey guys this is Basant here and welcome back to SASGO youtube channel in this video i am going to give you a detailed overview demo and the tutorial of app my site and show you how you can create a desired platform app with this tool here so without wasting any more time let's get started and if i talk about its pricing although you can sign up for the free and get started to creating the app but you need to pay for downloading that app and the publishing on the apple store or the android store after the payment you can download the app and publish it so this is the thing you can uh, notice here if you want to get started with free version but if i talk about its pricing you can see its pricing start from the 19 dollar per month you can see this is the monthly pricing you are getting here and you can see woocommerce to app wordpress to app or the website to app you need to pay uh, different pricing here and this is pay per app and if i click on the unlimited apps you can see the pricing is the 99 dollar per month 79 dollar per month or the 79 dollar per month so at least i can say you need to pay the monthly subscription here to use this platform but what if there's the one-time payment and you can use this platform forever so let me introduce the app sumo because here you can find out the lifetime deals about crazy stunning software so the app my site lifetime deal is also available here and you need to just pay these 59 dollars look at the pricing just 59 dollar one time payment here and you can create up to the three apps here no not one but the three three apps for from the paper app subscription three team members from the paper app subscription means you are getting the three apps for the lifetime you don't need to pay every month if i compare it here paper app let me show you because here you need to pay the around uh, 19 dollar and the 9 dollar you can see 19 dollar per month 9 dollar per month and here you need to pay just one time payment and if i talk about the other plans for example this is a tier 2 plan and this is a tier 3 plan here you will get the 10 apps from paper app and here you will get the 25 apps so this looks stunning if you are going to offer the uh, app building services for the wordpress users or the woocommerce users or the shopify users this is the plan you can get it and you can charge them like the 300 dollars 500 dollars and this is the totally worth it see this is the good thing that i really like about the app sumo lifetime deals so if i scroll down below you can read out build no code apps for android and the ios complete with home screens menu layouts and more customize and preview your apps design content layout with user friendly interface so you are getting the every feature that you are getting on the official site but paying the monthly here okay but if you also get its lifetime deal you are getting the all the features that i'm going to show you okay so this is the lifetime deal if you want to check it the link will be given in the description now let me give you the demo of this platform how you are going to use it so once you got its lifetime deal you can find the link in the description after that this is the onboarding process and you have to select pay per app because this is the plan for the pay per app okay so we will select pay per app and after that it will redirect to its dashboard okay so in the dashboard i think we need to create the workspace for the every app and i have already created with my apps name okay you can see this is the my account paper app and after that you can see my apps and now what i need to do i need to click on the get started so i will click it here and after that it will ask me to select the app name that i i am going to create so this is the process and the step by step tutorial start from here okay so i am going to name it demo app and after that it is asking me which kind of app it is it is the web 2 app wordpress app woocommerce app or the custom app so 
If you don't know about me, I run a WordPress site. I'm basically a WordPress user. So I have the WordPress sites and my website name is the sasguru.info with the same name that uh, my YouTube name channel. Okay. So in this website, you can see I just constantly update and review the platforms like the softwares, compare them. Everything I do basically in my channel, I do in my uh, WordPress site. So I will copy the link here and get back to the my uh, creation process. And here I will select the WordPress and after that i will add the website name so you can see this is the website name i have added and after that i will click on the create okay so now it will start connecting with my wordpress and it will start generating or creating the app okay so we are in the designing and the creation process and here are the some steps available okay you can see demo app this is the website name and it is basically showing me all the things so let's get started to creating the app so first we are going to create the app icon and these are the step by step process you can see so we click on the app icon and here it will ask me to upload the image which will be used as the icon for the app so what i can do i can design it or i can upload it so simply i will click here go to the browse and select the image from my uh, desktop here so i can choose any of them so suppose i just choose my own image as the demo okay so i will click on the done and now this image will be used as the app icon see and now we have done the app icon uh, step here and you can see this step is the pretty much clear like this is the on the uh, low color grading but this is the uh, you can see with the uh, clear color means this step is done now we have to click on the launch screen now in this step we are going to set up the launch screen and you can see start designing or upload the image so i will simply click on the start designing and basically on the upload image process you have to again upload your own image and used as the uh, startup screen here so you can see we have the tons of great templates available we can use but we can also uh, upload here we have the photos available we can use it okay now this looks good okay and after that what i can do i can also add the objects these are the objects and i can show them so this is the our launch screens for the app and we have done it and you can see the uh, all the things we have done are saving here so this is done again we need to go back to the dashboard and now our two steps are done so that is the way we are going to do all these steps and in the end our apps will be created then after that you can see uh, we have to set up the login and sign up page we have to add the colors theme we have to add the home screen install plugin okay so basically for these five steps we are customizing the looking of our website and from this site we are going to connect our app with our website to fetching the data to getting the database and granting access and after that we can add the menu bottoms and after that we can so I took few minutes and quickly done all this in uh, configuration options and now we have the option to install the plugin. So simply click on this step and it will offer you to install the plugin on your site. So I already installed the site, uh, this plugin on my site, app my site, create an app with the best app builder. So you have to install this one and after generating the D key, all you need to just click on the verify button and after that you can see it will show you this connect successfully okay so this is the thing you only need to do after that let's go to the next step that is the grant access and here what you have to do you have to enter your application username and password first so basically in the username you have to enter the username associated with your wordpress website so this is the username with which you use to log in on your wordpress database and this is the application password and this is the different password first you need to set up in your uh, wordpress site if you have installed the app my site so let me show you how you can do that go to the your wordpress site word uh, profile section for example if i click here you can see this is the edit profile simply click here and here uh, after checking out your username you can see this is the options here you have to add your new uh, application password name basically it will be the name and after that it will generate the password you can see add new application password it will generate the password and now when you got the password you have to enter it here okay so simply that's how you will get your username and the password and now let's click on the verify so it will take few seconds to check out all the things if the things are correctly 
and you can see API keys submitted successfully and now our WordPress site database is connected with the app okay so till now we have almost completed all the tasks here and there are the few things still uh, remaining so let's quickly do that too and you can see we have installed the plugin we have the grant access with the database now this is the some monitoring option let me also check out so what are the things it can do okay basically it will check out the uh, frequency of the your database monitoring okay so what i can do i can enable it and it will give me the updates daily weekly or monthly basis whether the database connecting uh we have just set up the connection is working fine or not so this is what the its monitoring section will do then we have the uh this app menu so i think this is the really uh cool thing we need to do that because here we are going to set up the menu for our app okay so i want to add the home i want to add the blog i want to add about videos and settings so let's remove the settings then this is the email call and share so i also want to remove the call okay then this is the share button i think share button is good okay so i have just quickly set up up my uh, menu option for my app so let's get back to the dashboard and here we have to uh, click on the android because we want the android app okay so simply i will click on the android okay but if you want the ios you also can uh, click on the ios app and here you can see build android app or build ios app so simply click here build android app and here you can see enable push notification enable social login so we can always do that later so simply click on the uh, build app and now you can see our app is done so within the few seconds you can check out without uh, any coding needed i just created my app and now it is ready to publish on the play store so i will also give you the preview how this app is working but as for now it is the initializing so it will it can take few more seconds so please some uh, have some wait here so while it is taking time to processing your app what you can do you can preview your app how it's look like in the different mobiles so it will give you the preview on the ios devices and the android device you can select the uh, device here for example for this is for the android and this is for the ios and here you can see it you will also got the option to test the app on real devices so simply click here you need to uh, scan these qr codes and it will install the app whether it's the ios or the uh, your android app okay so i'm going to preview it on the screen here so i can also give you the uh, overview how it is looking like so simply click here click to start and that's how it is going to start on the ios and let's cl also click on the android app okay so you, you can see it is asking me some of the allowance so i will click on the allow and that's how our app is previewing and you can see this is the my ports i didn't manually add them i just uh, connected my database with the this app and now you can see here this is the categories so if i scroll above you can see these are the some categories because i haven't any images on the categories on my whatsapp that's why it is also showing me just the uh, text on these uh, 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 category bars okay and these are some of the other options okay i like this much really cool because as for no coding i think this looking really stunning and the layout is really different compared to my website so uh, ordinary people will not know whether i actually built with the coding or just <laughs> created with the app my side this is the cool part and this is the option you can check out for the menu we have added and let me clo close this one let's also check out on the android app okay so let me scroll and i think the same view all i am also getting in the android okay so in the both platform the app is working really fine if i click on the blog and this is the my blog page will open and i can just uh, filter out the uh, these blogs layouts for example this is the uh this is the uh, grid view okay but i can also make it like this kind of the uh, horizontal previews okay so simply i think this is the working fine if i open any of these uh posts to read out let's see what it looks like so this is the my main image this is the uh, me as the uh, user writer then i have scroll down below let's check out images i think it is looking really good because the images are also uh, neat and clean the look at the database basically is really cool here because compared to my website i make a lot of good things to make my post stand out but in comparison to those this app make it really easy to read and in user interface so that's how it will look like 
once your app is done so i have just give you the basically the some basic steps because my website is not the e-commerce it is the blog type uh, website but whether you are a blogger you are a e-commerce user because you can also create the or connect the same way that i have connected using my website for with the app my site plugin here okay then we have the notification basically i can also connect to give the notification to all my app users then this is the chat option i can also merge the app this is the monetization if you want to earn some money this is the monetization option you are also getting then this is the user suppose you want to offering some memberships uh, app then in the users you can check out what are the users uh, login registrations you got okay so the as for the platform it is really easy neat and clean the process is really easy after playing out its uh, interface its uh, uh, features to create or uh, configure your app it's really easy to get started okay so this is the app my site i have gave you detailed overview and tutorial how you can use this platform to uh, launch or create your app no matter it's the uh, normal site no matter it's your uh, advanced e-commerce you can create any kind of it here and the best thing you don't need any coding is so as for now if i talk about this pricing is 59 is just really affordable and in just uh, uh, one time of the 59 dollar you can create and launch up to the three websites sorry three apps in the ios and the android for both and if i talk about the manually building your app from the developers for the individually platforms like the uh, ios and the play store you need to pay thousands of dollars but here you are saving those uh, thousands of dollars okay so that's all for today's video i hope you enjoyed this detailed overview of the app my site make sure to hit the like button and if you have any questions regarding this platform or the app some more you can just ask me there i will help you out bye bye take care and i will see you in the next one